everyone, welcome to Adult DIY. Today we'll be making a flower crown wreath. So you can either hang it up as a wreath or wear it as a crown. Um, so you should have um, some wire, um, some flowers, uh, some floral tape, and some ribbon. You will probably, you'll need scissors, and uh, that, that is the only thing that wasn't provided. Um, so the first thing you'll do is just take your wire. Um, it's already cut to the appropriate length. If you want it shorter to make a smaller um, wreath, then you'll have to cut it. Um, but it's already cut to the, to the length for the flower crown. So what we're gonna do is um, just loop the edges. So at each end, you're just gonna make a little loop like that. Just nice and simple and then we're just going to connect them so there we go and you tighten the, the wire right there and then you have this nice little uh, circle made of wire so the next step oops put that back together again and twist the wire a little bit so it stays closed a little better Okay, so there we go, we've got a nice little circle. Um, and the next step is to take your floral um, tape. So you'll use one section to wrap the whole uh, circle and then you'll use another section to wrap the flowers onto the, uh, the crown. Okay, so I'm just gonna take the first part off and we're just gonna start wrapping um, around the crown. And this is just to um, make it like an even base, um, give it a little bit more uh, depth, thickness. Um, so basically, you're just going to wrap this all the way around. I'm only going to do a little bit just to for the sake of time, but you're going to just wrap it all the way around um, until it covers the whole circle. So you'll get to the whole to the other side. Um, all right, so I'm just gonna stop there though, just for the sake of time, for the video. And then the next step is figuring out where you're going to put your flowers. So you should have gotten an assortment of flowers and leaves, artificial, um, in your kit. Whoa, all right. So um, you wanna figure out how you're gonna arrange your flowers. Um, I was thinking of mine, so this is my uh, original, or this is my example, um, and I have some flowers over here, and that's where I also extended my ribbon, so if you were to wear it, um, the ribbons would go down the back of your head, um, and then if you're hanging it up on the on your door or wall, um, the ribbons would hang down on the side like that, so it's a asymmetrical um, design. So that's what I'm going to go for with um, this crown. So I have my my leaves and I'm just going to use the tape to secure it to the um, to the crown. So you want to just place it the flower the flowers and leaves and play around with the design that that you're gonna eventually want and don't forget we still have ribbons to play with as well um, all right so when you've decided you're gonna take your floral tape um, you can rip it up into little uh, pieces to make it easier to work with on this one um, all right so I'm gonna attach this one I'm I'm using my flowers to cover up the hooks or the, the enclosure but the tape when when you do the floral tape it should cover it up a little bit as well um, when you go all the way around the circle. All right, so I'm just using the floral tape to just attach it. <laughs> all over the place today. Okay. All right. I'm gonna rip some of that off. You can also use scissors. It is pretty easy to to rip though, but I know sometimes scissors are just nicer to use, so whatever you like. All right, I'm just going to wrap it around so it's nice and 
uh, tight there. And then I'm going to start on my other leaves, which I'm just going to put just like that. And use the same piece of floral tape. Um, all of the materials are from Michaels, and then some of the the fly the flowers are from Dollar Tree. So there's lots of fake flowers out there um, that you can use to make flower crowns or you know to decorate um, your home all year round. Okay, so I'm good with the leaves. Ripping it around. Okay, let's see. Okay, now I'm going to attach my flower right in the center. My flower has a little stem, um, which makes it easier to tape um, onto the wreath. So I'm going to take the rest of this tape um, to attach it. flower design um, so I've got my big flower in the middle and the leaves on the side um, so I like that design so I'm going to add the ribbon now so the ribbon I have two different colors there are they are about five feet long each um, so what I'm going to do is just tie it to this end of the crown right here um, I'm going to do a mixture of purple and pink. You can, you know, you don't have to use a ribbon. Um, you can use a one color if you like. Um, okay. So yeah, I just tied it on one side. So I want um, a shorter one to that will hang down either on your on your head or on. The wall or door and then what I'm gonna do is just wrap these two ribbons all around um, the circle to the other side so I want it to be um, uh, colorful so I'm gonna use the two whoops it's getting caught in my leaves. Okay, so it's a little bit tricky around the flowers, but then once you get past your fl uh, flowers, you'll be it'll be easier to wrap. Okay, and for the sake of time, I'm only going to do this for. I'm not going to do the whole crown, but I'm just going to show you what my technique is or, you know, just how to do it. Um, just wrapping it around. Oh, my ribbon got caught, of course. Okay. Got a little twisted. All right. All right, so basically you're just gonna do that, um, twist the ribbon around just like that until you get to the other side. And then you're gonna tie it at the end there. And then it should look something like this. There you go. So you can see this one I used green and yellow. I wrapped it all the way around um, to the other side and I tied it there. And then I have this nice little um, trail of ribbon which I'm going to leave. Um, you can cut it to your desired length, but I'm going to leave mine so it can it can hang down. Um, so yeah, have fun with have have fun with the design of the flowers um, and the ribbons. You know, uh, be
be as creative as you like, but um, it's pretty simple. You just use the, the floral tape to connect the flowers to the wire and um, then the ribbon just to add some extra decoration. Um, so that is all for today. If you have any questions, please email askref at almaparklibrary.org and please take a picture and send it of your uh, final um, product. Um, and look out for the summer newsletter because we're going to do um, adult DIYs, a fresh set of adult DIYs for the summer, June, July, and August. And the signups for um, the summer adult DIYs are um, May 20th. So on May 20th, you should have your uh, newsletter already and you should be able to sign up for all of the summer programs. So can't wait for that and I hope you enjoyed this adult DIY. Thank you so much.